Welcome! In front of me I have Huawei Watch GT5 Pro and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing we need to do is to turn on our watch and you can turn it on by pressing and holding the uh, crown button. Keep holding the button until you see the Huawei logo on the screen. And once you see the logo you can release the button and wait until the watch is done uh, booting up. Once the watch is done booting up, you may see the list of languages on the screen. If you see it, scroll through this list, find the language you would like to use on your watch, and once you find it, uh, tap on it to select it. And now we need to download and install the Huawei uh, Health application on the iPhone we want to pair our watch with. If you want to, you can tap on use QR code and basically scan the QR code with your iPhone to go to the download page of the app. I'm just gonna use the App Store instead. And to download the app, you will need to have the internet connection and to pair the devices, you will need to have the Bluetooth enabled. Okay, so once you have the internet connection and Bluetooth, download the app. So I'm gonna open the App Store, tap on search, tap on the search bar and type in Huawei Health. And on the list of apps, we should see this application, Huawei Health. Tap on it, tap on the get button to download and install it. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on open button right here to open it. And after you open the application, you may need to select the service region. To do it, tap right here and scroll through the list, find the region you want to use. And once you find it, uh, tap on it to select it, for example, the United States. Then tap on next, here tap on next, agree. Allow or deny the permission for the notifications. This is useful if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. If you don't care, you can deny it. If you want to use it, tap on allow. Then you will see the health kit. And here we need to tap on let's go. And right here we have different health features and we can allow the app to write and re read the data from them. So if you want to use some of the features like heart rate, sleep and stuff like that, you will need to allow the permissions but you can also keep them denied if you don't care. I'm gonna tap on turn on all and then tap on allow, but you can also tap on don't allow if you like to. And once you're done with the permissions, you should see the health page of the app. Tap on devices, tap on add device, tap on allow, and uh, tap on add device again. The app will start searching for the nearby devices and it should, it should see your GT5 Pro, watch GT5 Pro. Tap on the connect button next to it. Tap on the check mark on the watch. Tap on pair on your iPhone. Allow or deny the permission for the notifications. Here check the box and tap next. And right here we can allow the permissions for contacts, location and something else I believe. Contacts are required if you want to see the uh, notifications about calls, I believe. So basically if somebody calls you, it will display the name of the contact and the number. So if you need that, tap on allow. If you don't care, you can tap on don't allow. Next we have the calendar access. This is for the events. So basically you will see the notifications about the events and stuff like that. Allow or deny it. Then we have the location permission, and this is useful uh, for the local weather, uh, tracking your routes on the map and stuff like that. So allow it or deny it. And right here, we can check the boxes to auto download the update packages and auto install them. So if you don't want to deal with installing it manually, you can check the boxes and tap on uh, done. And finally, you should see your Huawei Watch GT5 Pro on the device page. And if you wake up the screen on your watch, you should be able to use it which means that the devices are paired uh, together. And that's how you pair this watch with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.